everybody, this is Super Mario Link. You welcome back to more Paper Mario Thousand. In the last episode, we finished off Bowser and Gross took Peach into this room. In this episode, once we step in here, there's no turning back. Let's go. Too bad for you, Mario. You're too late. What's happening? Get it. Look well. In the coffin behind me sleeps a legendary treasure. Its tomb holds the soul of that ancient demon, the wielder of destruction. It will possess Peach's body and bring life to the most powerful witch in millennia. Possess Peach? But Mario, I'm so, so sorry. Sending you that map caused all this trouble, didn't it? Yeah, with the power of the demon, I will rule this pathetic world. Time has come at last. The world will be mine. Now, arise! Arise, my Shadow Queen! The candle candles turning... That color is already bad. Wow, only a few humans notice. But brother, the sky, it's... What's all this? The sky. It's turning dark. Who has called me back? It is I, my Shadow Queen. You. Very well. Where is the vessel? It is here, the girl who lies before you. Yes, a fine vessel. Now. That's really creepy. <laughs> if they got scared of the sky turning dark, wait, how would they notice? Because it's already darker. What? Help me! What's all this then? Am I to do that this is the end of the world? What was that? Something terrible has happened. No kidding. No. Could that dark power have truly awakened? No! This is unthinkable! Whoa. <sighs> Witness my rebirth. My soul has not yelly, yelly, yet fully accustomed to this vessel. But I will learn to the control this body soon enough. But Peach, 
Yes, my glorious witch queen. Destroy these impudent fools. Who are you that would command me? What sort of being are you? Huh? What do you mean? I thought you were bound to obey the, obey the one who woke you. Enough of this prattle. Do as I say. Now, or I'll send you back to the depths. Whoa. You would do well to learn your proper place, slave. No one commands me. My powers are not, not yet fully restored, but they will come in time. But Mario, I don't understand. My queen! You have returned to us. Ah, Beldum, what ages have passed? So, you're the one truly responsible for calling me back, yes? Yes, my queen. I searched for a pure maiden that you might inhabit. And as I did, I spread the rumor of a great treasure. That I led the fools who had gathered the crystal stars here to open the seal. Yes, you have fully... You have fulfilled your duties admirably. I'm not worthy, my queen. And who are these beings that stand before me? You don't even recognize Vivian? Yes. They do not appear to possess power, but they may be of use. If you will become my faithful servants, I will not harm you. Mario, I promise to follow you. I believe in you. If you say, um, become her servant, it will be an instant game over. I see. So you defy me. How amusing. Then you wretched fools, you will learn the error in your ways. Okay, the final battle of the game, and you're foolish to oppose me. Yes, and that foolishness will have to be punished. Moro, I will follow you to the end, I swear it. I feel bad for the princess, but that queen must fall before us. And once she does, you and I can't... Well, anyway, let's take this fight to her. Okay, so, power lift. Let's do that. was good Dang he damage Wow One hundred fifty HP Man that was a lot of damage Power lift went away. Hmm, so you're not weak. Maybe you're less useless than you appear. This body is unfamiliar to me. Yes, too unfamiliar. Let me assume my true form and show you real power. In this form, your attacks are like those of a child to me. You're lucky you will perish with the honor of having seen true terror and power. <laughs> okay, when she's in this form, impossible to damage her. No way is it possible. And I will prove it to you next episode.